Hello and welcome. Today we're going to talk about how to remove the words powered by WordPress from the bottom of your WordPress site. The words powered by WordPress is located at the bottom of your WordPress sites page. It is also linked to WordPress.org. So on this video, I'm going to show you how to change the text and also how to remove the link to WordPress.org. Now on this video, I'm using the theme 2012 for my website or my WordPress site. So the steps outlined on this video will be applicable to themes like 2012, 2013, 2014. Please note, however, that you cannot use the same steps outlined in this video on all themes. So uh, you can only use it on some themes. That's because the others are programmed or coded differently. So with that, let's go ahead. First, go to your dashboard. Then go to Appearance. Click it. Then go to Editor. Now, when you're on this page here, you'll see on the right side, we have several links. Look for the one that says Footer. Click it. So once you click on footer, it should take you to this page. Now on this page here, what we need to find is the words or the phrase proudly powered by, here you go, and the WordPress. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to change this. No need to remove this part, just the words. So let's type website designed by your name okay for the WordPress just delete it click on update file once you've clicked on update file check your website Then scroll down to that part. As you can see, it's now saying website designed by Ollie. It's not saying the words, or it's not showing the words proudly powered by WordPress anymore. So that's how you change the words proudly powered by WordPress to any text that you like. But as you can see, those words still has this link. When you click on this link, it takes us to WordPress.org. The link is still active, even though we have managed to change the text. So, we can leave it at that. We can just change the text, never mind about the link, and then save it. Or, we can change the text and remove the link altogether. So, what's going to be left is just a bunch of words. Let me show you how to do that. Let's go back to the dashboard. Let's go back to editing that footer. So appearance, editor, footer. Okay, now we're back. Now, this part right here, where it begins with a bracket and then A space href, all the way to this part here that ends with bracket slash a bracket this part right here is the link itself as you have noticed it has the words that we have edited earlier inside of it well that's because the words are part of the link so Here's how we will change this to something that is not a link anymore. Please note that you only need to work on this part, no other. Because if you kind of mess up the other parts of this footer code, well, the website might get a little messy or you might get an issue with the website. So please 
for the link only work on this part this highlighted part now let's proceed so instead of a h r e f we're going to replace this entire part right here with this type in a bracket p like paragraph then close it so another bracket and then type the words that you like website designed by ollie and then type in another bracket and then slash p and then bracket after that click on update file and then let's check scroll down to the bottom there you have it as you can see we have the words website designed by Ollie but you cannot click on it anymore there's no more link to go to wordpress.org so that's how you do it so that's how you change the words proudly powered by wordpress and also remove the link for wordpress.org thanks and i'll see you in the next video